We wanted to feature some of the wonderful photographers who capture the essence of the Pocono Mountains from as far south as Jim Thorpe to the northern end here on the upper Delaware River. It's a beautiful time of year no matter what time of year, winter, spring, summer, or fall. And those photographers are able to capture those images, upload them to social media, and as the saying goes, the best camera you have is the one on you. Matt Cannon has been pointing his Nikon on the Poconos for a few years now, capturing the region's beauty, including here along the Lehigh River. And Andrea Killam, another professional photographer, has been going the distance for amazing views, including here along the Delaware River. Both are among the many of us who share images of the Pocono Mountains with the world via social media, Instagram, and others. The Poconos offer really a great dynamic elevation change. You could be at 400 feet in one minute, and an hour later, you're 1,500 feet. Um, so it, there's great change and gives photography a lot of depth. Uh, so the light hits really well, uh, casting across the valleys, and it's just beautiful to be up here. Cannon, whose handle is at Matt's Focus, took us on a shoot along the Lehigh River near Jim Thorpe. He only started photography a few years ago and now is making a living doing it. But it's more than just that. It's a love for the subject matter, whether it's skyscrapers in the Big Apple or downtown Jim Thorpe, a favorite of Matt's to shoot. Just recently, the at Pocono Tourism Instagram account featured Matt's work and followers showed their love in return. Jim Thorpe is, I think, really an eclectic cool, like, it's it's not something you would expect to find in the northeastern area of Pennsylvania. Uh, and it, it's really charming. I, I love just how intimate that little main street of town is. Andrea Killam has the same love for the Delaware here on her friend's Sylvania tree farm near Lackawaxen. Not only has she taken stunning images like these, she's also done work for some iconic Pocono resorts. We do have um, beautiful historical destination um, locations like Skytop Lodge, where I've been fortunate enough to shoot, and, um, and you know, the lodge at Woodlock. And Killam helps make them stand out. She also aims to help people by telling their stories through still images. I try to share positive, beautiful things. I think that, the, you know, we're all inundated with enough of the opposite every day. And certainly I, I hear a lot of positive feedback from people that they appreciate it and it's like a respite for the eyes and Instagram for me has helped get my work out there. For both photographers and countless others, the Poconos is an ideal focus for their lenses and encourage everyone else to get out and take photos no matter what you use. In this area, there are endless opportunities to get strong photos, whether you're a pro or a hobbyist. And right now, during the COVID pandemic, people are missing that human connection. And I think seeing pictures of people just living their daily lives, if that's, you know, helping someone get through their day a little better by like seeing life the way that it actually is, that, that's a great thing. And I like to show that. Taking photographs, but giving a whole lot more back to all of us. Make sure you tag yes PMVB on any of those photos you want shared. Again, that's hashtag yes PMVB. Jim Hamill for the Pocono Television Network.